When the battle is over for those who will not survive COVID-19, the war begins for another group of people. We're not talking about first responders, but the last responders. Regina Mobley joins us from her home now with this story. Regina? Well, Stephanie, the former chief medical examiner for the state of Virginia applauds the hard work of those on the front lines, but she is calling on the people of Virginia and the nation to pause and think about those who are last in line to help the victims of COVID-19. Last responders, those who work in the funeral service industry, crematoriums, and medical examiners who handle the dead are exposed to the coronavirus on a day-to-day -day basis. The bodies have to be respectfully processed, and these folks go to work every day putting themselves in harm's way, just like many of our other unsung heroes. Dr. Leah Bush, as a contract medical examiner on a daily basis, handles the remains of four to five people who have died from the coronavirus. Funeral home employees, crematory employees, just like medical examiner staff, have been taught to treat everybody mm -hmm. like they are infected with some uh, pathogen that could uh, devastate your health. Her concerns are now on the record in a letter to the editor published last week in the Richmond Times Dispatch. What can be done to help last responders in the event something like this happens again? This isn't going to be the last one. So I think our health departments are really the ones on the front line here. And they're doing a great job trying to surveil and do surveillance. Now, there are so many unknowns about the coronavirus, and Dr. Bush, who does not speak for the state, says quite often medical examiners are the first to identify an unusual infection. And one other note, researchers in Bangkok, Thailand, say a medical examiner has died after having direct contact with a corpse that was COVID-19 positive. Now, tomorrow, Dr. Bush will explain how those who deal with death could play a role in saving lives. I'm Regina Mobley, 10 on your side.